Watch you guys today we're taking a look at how to type with your voice using Google Docs. Now this has been around for quite a while but it's become very accurate at the way you can type documents. So open up Google Docs and go to a blank document and once you're inside here you will be able to type out all of the docs that you want using your voice. You can give it clear instructions using the commands that have been designed by Google to make it easier to type out documents with your voice. Now these can be adding simple commands in like comma, new paragraph, new line, highlight text, strike through, just a few that it can actually do. There's tons of Google Docs commands that you can use to type out your documents using your voice. So once you've got your microphone enabled here, you're ready to go. You will need to set your microphone up so it can accept uh, voice to text, but it is pretty straightforward and I'll show you a document in a second. But before we do that, let's have a quick word from today's video sponsor, CD Key Cells. If you're looking for a cheap Windows 10 Pro or a cheap Windows 11 Pro OEM key, then check out the links in the video description. Click on those and it will take you to CD Key Cells website. Use my promo code capital B capital R 09 and apply this to your order and you will get a 30% discount on all of your purchases. They will then ship you the key once you pay with PayPal and you can activate your version of Windows. Okay, before we start, let's have a look at Google Docs' information. This tells you how to set up your microphone and basically some of the commands that you can use when you're using Google Docs, like period, comma, exclamation point, question mark, new line, new paragraph. Now, period, in the UK, we use full stop. So you will change that to full stop if you're using United Kingdom English and it will change those words for you. So down here, you will see select text and there's a bunch of select text commands you can use. And there's also format your document for text formatting like underline, title case, lowercase and many, many more. OK, so let's take a look at how this works. So basically, when I turn the microphone on, it's going to start copying everything I say in the microphone and putting this into a document like this right here. So you can give it clear instruction what you want to say. For instance, I can say full stop new paragraph and this will give us a new paragraph as you can see here. OK, so let's take a look at Google Docs and some of the commands you can use. So first off, let's do comma and we can add a comma into our particular document. Next up, we're going to go full stop new line. And this will give us a new line in that document. We can also use full stop new paragraph. And you guessed it, it will give us that new paragraph. There we go, another one. Now, what you can do as well is you can select paragraph. Sometimes it's not that accurate. So what you can do is select it yourself like so. And you can either use these up here or you can instruct it to do it like this. Bold. Strike through. And there we go. So they're the actual commands you can give it. It's pretty accurate. And uh, when I turn the microphone on, it's going to allow me to basically give it these commands. You can change color as well. So let me show you this one as well so we can do that. So I'm going to turn the microphone on and highlight it. Text, color red and there we go so let's go ahead and show you some of the commands that you have here so for instance i can select paragraph bold anyway that is google docs it's very very powerful and uh, it's just getting better and better over time uh, there's loads of other commands you can use i've only just shown you a small fraction i'll leave a link in the video description with all of the commands that they do offer and uh, if you're into this sort of thing that where you can get a document locked up very, very quickly, you can edit it manually afterwards and make some minor changes if you wish. Or you can use your voice and manually use your mouse and keyboard as well to make changes on the fly. It's very, very powerful. Anyway, with that said, I think that's going to be about it for this video. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to all my YouTube members. I appreciate the support. Have a lovely weekend and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye for now.